in the 20th century, if you had something to say in public, you couldn't, period. Now with the internet, people have access to create and distribute on their own. The web is about connecting humanity. It's what we are all about. Friendship, love, sex, knowledge, growth, all the imperatives that drive us as human beings. When you start seeing everyday life from everyday people on the streets, no matter what country they live in, I think it adds a very personal element. They have families, they have feelings, they have dreams, um, just like I do. Most of human activity is done without an exchange of, of money. You, for the record, are not paying me for this interview. I, for the record, am not paying you for this publicity. The difference about the internet, this is now being done on a global level. The web is like everybody lives in London. The web is like everybody has access to this enormous pool of people. Were it not for the internet, Barack Obama would not be president. It wasn't just because of the new media, it was about the way that he used the internet. Where people make their fundamental error who criticize all this is they think you either sit in front of a screen of some kind, or tapping away. <laughs> Don't touch! Don't do that! All your life going lol, or you sit in an old-fashioned study with books and you read properly and you engage properly. Well, I do both, and most people do both. It is not one or the other. I mean, I'm 60 years old. I wish I could live to be 200 to see how some of these things are going to resolve themselves. It's about funny cat videos. Boom. Boom.